So can I ask you today, when was the last time that you were afraid of something or someone or some situation that threatened to overwhelm you? Do you remember? So how did you handle that fear? Were you able to overcome it or not? Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond and welcome again to Fresh. We don't like to talk about it all that much, but fear strikes us more often than we'd like it to. In fact, some people live in a constant state of fear and foreboding. Can I ask you today, what do you do when fear strikes? You're afraid of losing your job. You're sitting in the doctor's waiting room about to go in to get those test results. You're afraid of having to deal with a situation that frankly, you'd rather sweep under the carpet. It's this sense of impending harm that's going to come upon you. What do you do with that? Sometimes, to put it bluntly, we do stupid things. We lash out at other people. We, we behave badly. Other times, we withdraw completely into this whole doom and gloom thing. But let's be honest, as much as they may be our natural reactions, sometimes neither of them are all that effective, are they? King David faced more than his fair share of threats. So many people tried to kill him from his predecessor Saul through to the enemies of Israel, hey, even his own son. But through it all, here's what he discovered. Psalm 34 verse 4, I sought the Lord and he answered me and delivered me from all my fears. Of all the things that you and I can possibly do when we're afraid, seeking out God, turning to him, praying, pouring out our hearts, this is the best thing that we can possibly do. Because when we do that, the Lord our God will deliver us from all our fears. That's God's Word fresh for you today. There have been plenty of times in my walk with Jesus when I've been afraid, but this is what I know. Whenever I've turned to Him, whenever I've opened His Word, the Bible, He has breathed peace and power into my heart. That's why I'd love to send you your fresh devotional each day, a powerful scripture verse together with some words of inspiration, hope and encouragement to help you be all that God made you to be. It's completely free. Stop by at ChristianityWorks.com for instant access. That web address again is ChristianityWorks.com. I'll catch you next time.